Hey, how you doing? I'm Lee in the Middle Tennessee area and I'm working on this, uh, doing a little brake job on this uh, first generation uh, Dodge Stratus. It's uh, the 95 to 2000 year models in them. I was just wanting to do a clean and adjust on these uh, drum brakes on the rear and just wanted to show you, I don't really like this different type of adjuster. I'm not really familiar with it. But on these, the longer, skinnier screwdriver you've got, the better. But take out your um, take your little uh, rubber plug that comes out of the back, and uh, it comes out. It's right here. And then you come in and you move. Uh, it has to engage in these big teeth on this thing, and you have to do a forward or reverse movement on that. And I don't know how I feel about this design. They may not use it anymore. I don't know. I'm not a pro full-time mechanic, but uh, I guess it's, a, you know, a quicker range of motion, unlike the old old style, but I think I like the old style better because it's it seems harder to see what you're doing on these. Um, it engages a knurled uh, knob in there. This part right here engages that knurled knob right there. So anyway, I, what I'd really want to do is it, just tighten up the e-brake. So I use it a lot. I guess I just feel safer on it. But anyway, I just thought that'd be helpful if somebody's fooling with these. But again, I wasn't doing. I'm not doing a full brake job. Just to clean and adjust and de-rust. And so I hope that helps somebody. Here's a. If I can get some decent light on this. Here's a where I kill the rust on this one brake drum. Hit it with some high temp flat black with some uh, high temp clear coat using my bench top lathe and I'll try to do a, a demo clip of that sometime it's pretty rad the way the uh, rust gets airborne and I inhale it and cause all kinds of respiratory discombobulation so anyway I hope that helps somebody take care have a good one bye